lovely weather. It's been raining for days. I've been waiting for the rain to stop to film this video and it's not gonna stop for weeks. Maybe ever. Right now it feels like ever. So I'm just gonna go ahead and do it. I did a painting video with the pigs a few videos ago. So today I'm going to be, look at how muddy and terrible it is. So today we are going to be having some of the dog's paint. The paint I'm using is non-toxic and safe and please don't just cover your pets in random paint. I think I'm gonna film this in the garage. Uh, thankfully it is washable paint so I can just clean the floor afterwards. Yeah, it's really cold. We are now in my garage. Uh, my garage could be cleaner, but it's not. So, you know, this is my garage. We're gonna start with Rory. Rory is four-ish years old, chihuahua-ish thing, and she is just a ball of energy. So this could be crazy. I'm gonna try to let her choose her own paint colors, but that didn't go so well with the pigs, so we'll see. The canvas is a little small. No, Rory, come on, focus. Don't like the cat. Excuse me. Come on, Rory. Um, so do we have any paint preferences? Any color choices? Would you like to touch any of the paint colors? Anything? Any colors? Hello? Okay, we have chosen just a bunch of bright colors that don't make any sense because that's kind of Rory. I have to walk around. Oh, the cats are gonna help you. Come on, Rory. Okay, guys, this isn't a group painting. What are you doing? I can't give, no, this is not yours. Oh my gosh. Oh no, they know I have treats. Oh no. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Rory, this is supposed to be yours. Come on, Rory. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I should have saw this. Hey, sneak? No, no. Oh no, I'm being attacked. Okay, well this is um, a collaboration piece between <laughs> Rory and the pack of cats that I sort of forgot would do this. Lisa is an aspiring artist and I never knew it. This is like dog prints, cat prints, probably some hair. Looks like there's a leaf chunk. You think this is yours? Just really, really beautiful. You proud of yourself? Oh look, he's already painting with dirt. Uh, so this is Pippin, and he's my, what, ten, nine, ten? Uh, mutt, who knows what he is. He just got a haircut. So it's a perfect time to paint. All right, so other than Pip's dirty little footprints, he looks really good in the color blue, so I think that means he likes it, I really don't know. Uh, so we mostly just done blues with his. This is Pippin's. Uh, he looks like a Smurf. He did pretty good though. Kind of like it. He also painted the floor, but like I said, it's washable. The next painter is Claire. She's a beagle that just found one day and she never left and we never found an owner. And so here she is. She definitely had a few litters of puppies before we found her. And so uh, I feel like that is very obvious in her personality because she's super tolerant and patient of everyone and everything. She's already stepped on it a little. I feel like she is not gonna pick any loud, crazy colors. 
so we kind of just went with some simple colors. Girl, you're doing so good. Yeah, yours is great. Yours is great, you like it too? <laughs> yeah, it's beautiful. Uh-huh. Are you not done yet? A few more paw prints? Wow, I'm actually super surprised that I don't have paint anywhere on my face. I'm covered everywhere else. I didn't think this through. I have to go out in public to the grocery store and stuff, so I'm gonna have to change my clothes or just decide I don't care, which I'll be honest is probably what's gonna happen. Uh, so the next dog is Dude or Doodlebug, and he's a dog that I was boarding, and the owners just thought he might be happier here. He was boarding and he never left. Um, he is a rat terrier, he's like 11 or 12 now. Uh, he's Mr. Sassy though, which I feel like is pretty typical of rat terriers or terriers of any kind really. They just sort of run the show. He didn't even wait for me to finish putting paint on the canvas before he was jumping all over it. Huh, you're in a hyper mood, bud. He does what we call around here the doodle march. He sticks his paws out really far and prances around everywhere, right? It's interesting, the doodle march is, uh, is making his very streaky. It's a super unique style you have, bud. Wow, this is very special. Hey, get out of the treat, sir. <laughs> Look at my garage floor. <laughs> You're gonna have to wash that. You enjoy painting, huh? Yeah, you like it? What a goofy boy. It's very green. The green kind of took over. I put some purple and yellow, but uh, he just looks green. Huh? Do you like green the most? All right, I'm gonna go bathe a bunch of dogs and myself and all my clothes and the garage floor. Uh, like with the pig paintings, I will post still shots of each one of them on Instagram, which is the same name here, Adri Rochelle. If you're not already following it and you like seeing my animals, I would suggest it.